it's Olga and this tutorial is about how to add custom email signature with social links to Mac Mail and Windows Outlook. We're going to learn how to edit HTML file that you would need for this custom signature. The file will be available for you to download in the link below. And then we're just going to go step by step on how to upload this edited file to Mac Mail and Outlook. Alright, so this is just a sample on the left hand side on how I created using this technique um, the custom signature with social links for myself in both mails with Mac Mail and Outlook. So let's get started. Step number one, please download HTML file from the link below and as you're done you should open one of your simple text editors. In Windows it will be WordPad and in Mac it is Text Edit. And I'm going to show this presentation on the Mac within Text Edit. So you open your text editor, either Text Edit in Mac or WordPad in Windows, go to File, Open and find the HTML file that you downloaded from the link below. Here it is, Open. Okay, this is the HTML code and if it looks for you like a foreign language that's okay, it's absolutely normal. I'm going to show you how and what you should edit in this file. Okay, so just breathe through. Alright, so let me walk you through this um, document and um, so you will understand what each line represents here, so it will be easier for you to edit it ac accordingly to your needs. Alright, so let's look here, dividend style, okay, let's just ignore it for now. A second line is heading and there is a style here, this is your font, this is the color, this is the size of your letters, and this is actually the text that is going to sh be showing on the first line in your signature. Let me show you right here, right here is this line, Olga Lishansky Frontline Marketing, this is right here. So if you want to change how this line looks, either the font family, you can enter right here, the color right here and I will provide you with a link where you can find a different color codes and the size you want to make it bigger you want to make it smaller you change it to 12 you change it to 20 very very simple okay let's leave it at 18 at this point okay that's the first line the second line is the second heading same idea different text okay exactly same thing and the next line is another heading it's connect with me another text again you can play with it around with color with font with size and obviously you enter your own text right here whatever text you want to be all right okay connect with me that was the text and okay so um, you can also remove if you don't want this to be here okay let's just remove it and then we'll save it and you'll see it will not appear connect with me line anymore okay let's re remove it okay good or you can add extra extra lines and extra text your phone number and so on next uh, let's move on and look into how to create in HTML or rather to edit in HTML these social icons so they are linked to your uh, business profiles. Alright, so let's move forward here. In the next line is actually the link to your Google profile. You can see the first one is Google Plus icon and here's where you specify right here your link to your profile in G+. Alright? So there are two lines associated with each social icon. One, the first one, is the actual link to your account, to your profile. 
with alternative text and the second line is the link to the image to the actually so they actually see this icon so that was for Google Plus you just have to update it with your own link to your account first and to the image second if you don't want to use my URLs or you want to add more icons this is it next one is Facebook and this is a link to your business or personal profile whatever you prefer and here's a link to the image or Facebook icon appears here and so on what you have to do is really very simple all right and just for the sake of the um, this presentation purposes I'm going to show you how to add extra icon so what I'm going to copy is let's say one of this line from E to A I'm just going to copy and add right here and I'm going to add a link and an icon to my blog on wordpress.org so let me get the information it should be right here okay that's good first of all instead of Twitter I'm going to add the link to my blog which is going to be HTTP as well olgalishansky.com forward slash blog okay make sure there's no any extra letters alternative follow us follow me on my blog and um, I have to insert a different image I mean image of wordpress.org icon which I have here the only thing I have it in 32 by 32 pixels so it will look a little bit smaller but that's okay it's just for presentation purposes so I'm going to insert it right here paste here it is and I'm going to save it as okay saving is very important when you save it as this is what I suggest you to do you have to actually type in dot HTML all right this is for the WordPress dot HTML you may play around with the text encoding but you may not but dot HTML you have to put in and then save okay already have this that's okay we're going to test it right now but before we go there I would like to mention one more thing in a text edit or wordpad in Windows go to preferences and make sure that plain text is selected and this is actually before you open this HTML file alright this is important All right now let's test it out go to your browser file open file and I'm going to find mine with WordPress okay so here it is we can see there is no third line join me or connect with me and also what there is a problem because this WordPress appeared on a different line so let's go back and let's fix it it's my mistake sorry so you see here this is a paragraph break we don't want the paragraph break here so we're going to have to do simply cut and put it at the end and let's see save as you do it the second time you don't have to do it dot HTML but the first time you have to we go back I'm going to refresh and here it is beautiful I mean not perfect but it's okay this is the idea I hope it's clear and I will go to the next step on how to actually upload this signature as you're happy with it into your mail